Hi, Teresa Madden here with TeresaMadden.com. Today is number 35 in my 100 day 100 video challenge. Today I am going to show you, it's going to be a little tricky, how to insert a PNG frame into a video. So what I'm going to do is, first off, I want to import my uh, my video that I made. The one that I'm specifically want to use today is this one. So I'm importing it because it's a movie. I made it in QuickTime, and I have a PNG. Uh, that I want to as well. Um, I'll, I'll frame a picture. Let's see. So let's see how that will work. There, dragged it over. So cancel that. What I'm going to do is drag my video in here and we will start editing it. So we'll go by just playing and so we'll scoosh over there. So we get a Oops. Okay, so. Okay, so we're going to baseball fan right there. So we're going to go in and we're going to take that and we're going to pause it. We're going to find a team that we love, okay? So. Okay, so. So we're going to go to about 30. Okay. Okay. So we're going to go right here. I want to split the frame first off. Okay. And then I want to drag this PNG over here. Okay, and it goes right there in the frame. Okay, and then I'm going to take and first off, I want to just play this. Find a team that we love. So, say you're a baseball fan and you love the Seattle Mariners. So, I find a team that we love and you want to love the Seattle Mariners. We're going to take this, you could hear what I said, and I'm going to drag it. Now let's hit play again. You can hit the play or the space key. And just for using the mouse and my space key it seems to work easier for me, so that's what I'm doing. So listen to my recording what it says. Okay, so it stops right about there. So perfect, actually. Because that's on my second row there, it's superimposed over the video that was actually playing. And I can take this and make it bigger, and I will. So it's just going to. So let me drag this back over here the playhead. We're going to scrub it back over to where that starts. We're going to hit the space bar again to play. It showed the baseball field and so I can insert that and it took it right over the top of my 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 face, my frame. So if we have a photo that we like, something that plays into what we have, or words, if there's something we want to put um, on the page. I just wanted to show you this, and then this just goes on through the video and, and completes the video. But you can do this as many times as you want and superimpose it over the top. I hope you found this very helpful. I love new, learning new things about these tools and this Camtasia is 
fun. I would encourage you to upgrade to a video creator, a screen cast creator that um, you like. There's many out there that you can try for free and you get a test period of you know a week to 30 days it just depends and invest in one that works for you they're all very similar but some just work better for others and this happens to be a Mac program and I can't remember the comparable one for the PC. If you would like to have more tips and tools and just encouragement please trot on over to TeresaMadden.com don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, and that is Teresa Madden, D O T C O M, TeresaMadden.com as well. I will see you tomorrow for video number 36. Until then, dare to dream.